Fraser, was that yeah. the best Blues team you've come up against in your tenure as the Crusaders coach? Ah, it's best performance. Um, they took opportunities early and showed me desperate as you would be after 18 years. You know, you want to uh, come down here and uh, turn their tide, and they did. You know, I'd officially just I'd like to congratulate Leon and, and the team for uh, you know winning a, a gritty win, a real gritty, gritty performance, and we threw everything. We still had opportunities, and what a game! Obviously, a really kind of tight finish in that second half in particular. Yeah. Um, do you feel like it, maybe you just left it a bit late to try and mount that comeback? Had the game almost got away too much by the time that came around? Uh, we were down here with three minutes to go, so that's, that's enough to score twice, a few tries in. Uh, you know, obviously Dom in the corner here, and we're going around the corner. Uh, they're extremely disciplined, and they just keep getting up. Um, so... Yeah, look, you, you, you've got to give it to them. We gave ourselves opportunities. We probably could have started better uh, and have been a little bit better disciplined. Ironically, we played better with probably a couple of guys in the bin, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, that's the irony of it. But it hurts, yeah. Scott Barrett, red card. What, what's your read on that? Uh, the rules, eh? He's uh, got to be better technically, and um, we'll see what happens this week. Another one at lock, two raiser, you can't quite yeah. take a trip there, can you? If, if you lose it for yeah. a few weeks. Yeah, yeah, look. Yeah. Yep, so Sam comes back, which is good timing, and obviously Zach put some shift in for a young 20 year old, didn't he? He was exceptional, 80 minutes, and just kept getting up, and he's got a big future. So that's one. There's a couple, there's a lot of positives out of the game, but obviously the, the result's the one that would love to have got. You know, a couple of points there, you think the game could have gone away, it could have been two or three score games, and then we nearly won it at the end, and it just shows. Oh, there's a lot of care in the group, but we wanted to, you know, we wanted to perform and keep that, keep that rolling. So, it wasn't quite meant to be. I was going to say, you said before it hurts, and during the week you said how massive that 18 that record was against them. Yeah. yeah. How much does it sting, and the reaction you'll expect uh, you know, moving on from us? Uh, just, yeah, I would like to have. You know, it's in your tenure and your and your and your coaching. You want to. You, you know, you get a few records, but you want to keep that one. You know, you're, it's a record that um, you, you realise. I think all it is is a good chance to reflect, really, on what it does take and how desperate teams are and how big games are and how to win big ones. You've, you, you've just got to be on. Um, so it's a good reminder for us. Um, we'll reflect as a coaching group. We've been on tour for four weeks now, or well, for four games, three and a half weeks. Crusaders tour well. Uh, so it's a... It's a good chance for us to, to reflect and there's plenty of the comp left. Yeah, I was going to say, I mean, obviously, you know, t- you don't win titles in the middle of April, do you? No, you don't. Uh, but what you learn in, in those months helps you win it. So you will remember. Um, and like I said, yeah, you got to move on pretty quick. You know, we've got Magic Crown in Melbourne. We'll get excited about that and get a few more players out there to um, give an opportunity in our jersey. Joe Moody, what's the initial... Joe's got a clunky knee, that's all I can say. He just didn't quite work when they went to bend it, so that's not the greatest um, uh, overview of his knee, but it, it, wasn't quite good. it wasn't good enough to carry on, so, yeah. yeah. Scott, um, Steve Hansen once said that he thinks that for a young player, sometimes it's actually beneficial to feel a pain of a loss, and he talked about the pain yeah. you're feeling as a coach. Yeah. Um, yeah. Is, is, that, is that one small positive you can take out of this oh, game? Yeah, it is, isn't our group? This, you know, this group hasn't... Like had that feeling and a lot of young guys and a, and a lot of old, older guys that haven't either you know 18 years is a long time and since the last time they've been it's what was this 2012 2014 14. you know so haven't had that uh, uh, and, and they just realised how desperate other teams are and you know we've had a lot of close games the last few weeks but it'll keep us sharp uh, yeah when do you, uh, what's the plan in terms of when do you head over to Melbourne and uh, Friday afternoon for the Sunday game We'll get back together Tuesday as a group, so we're going to have a long weekend, uh, a few Easter eggs. Yeah. Just quickly on the young guys, like yeah. you had Zach, you also had Don Gardner, you know, playing in games like this, I mean, how much is that boat for them? Oh, I've ticked up 20 holes a lock, it's pretty awesome, isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah, you sort of didn't imagine at the start of the year that they'll be running out, you know, in a game and finishing, but look, their performance and how they played and the, how brave they were and the skill set was an, an, an immense, so we go straight away. We do build a little bit of depth coming into the back end of the season, you know. Top eight out of 12, 
Um, you're rolling, you're starting to be at home as much as you can in the final season, but um, there's a lot more to, to happen in the next few weeks. Yeah. Um, you spoke during the week yeah. um, about you know this rivalry and, and I suppose how, how special it is for Super Rugby, how important it is for Super yeah. Rugby. How important do you think a spectacle like that will be, you know, being on the, on the yeah. losing side? How, how big the, was that for the competition? Fear the competition would have been cheering in the televisions for for probably the Blues in a lot of ways, just, you know, with the, the nature of it and get up and um, teams. But that's the rivalry, you need it. You know, they need the big matches and the quality of the match and the, the finish and the finale and the theatrics was pretty good. It's tough. In the box, we were pretty calm. We, we, we thought we'd have, we just needed one more shot and we would have taken it, but uh, it wasn't meant to be this time.